Hi folks, welcome to another Fusion Friday. We had a question from a person. Say you've got a block of material with two holes going straight through it. And let's say you want to put a 45 degree hole going from one of those to the other one. I'll show you how to do it. Pretty simple. Let me go to Construct, Plane at Angle. And it's going to ask for a line. And this is one of those things where you just have to experiment sometimes. I ended up clicking on this line and realized, in fact, you can even drag it, which makes it nice, and put it at a 45. And you can see that's going to give us the angle we want. Click OK. I'm going to hit C for circle. Click on that plane we just created. It, go ahead, it automatically orients the model normal too. So we're looking down it. And I'm going to hit. Uh, click right somewhere in here and say 0.125 and boom there's my hole Q for press pull and you can drag it through or even better we can change it the extents from distance to 2 click that and then you can see it pops it right through like so and you can see I'm actually clipping that a little right there I'll show you in a second um, how we could fix that. Now the other thing is section views. Now it's as good as any to learn section views. I'm going to put a midplane in first. Construct, midplane, pick this face and that face and you can see I get a plane right down there. Go to inspect, they call it section analysis, whatever. And all you got to do is click this plane and click OK. And look, now I have, I didn't change the model, I just added this view it lets me see that orientation and if you go to analysis I can toggle it on and off super useful folks to set these up uh, we can turn off our construction plane as well uh, to set these up when you build more complex parts because you can basically take a peek inside now if we didn't want to uh, have that part clip that hole there the best way that I can think I'd actually love to hear, folks, I'm sure there's a better way. But we could do now an offset plane. Click this. Oh, no, orient it on the front. And we can drag it. Actually, maybe now's a good time. Hey, use our section view. And we can drag it so that we're just starting that plane right there. And turn that off. Now, I wonder if, if I right click on the first sketch choose redefine sketch plane okay the only reason I can't choose actually sorry it's this one um, if I move this stuff earlier into the yeah it's not gonna let me redefine it because I created that plane afterward uh, I was hoping I could just move the geometry over but now what we could do is um, let's see here yeah there we go so right click Redefine sketch plane and pick there. Click OK. Uh, I lost my extrude though. Press pull. Well, where is that? Turn off these planes now. Edit the sketch. Now, if I hit Q, pick that. Yeah, it didn't quite work quite as well as I had hoped to have it just sort of automatically update. But um, do click there like so. Turn on my section analysis. There you go, folks. Hope you enjoyed. Take care. See you next Friday.